Leslie, we have had two years of very active hurricane yeah. seasons. We're not the only ones who are seeing extreme weather. There's extreme weather in all parts of the country right now. Brandon Lewis from our National Verify team looks into why these once rare events are happening more frequently now. Some meteorologists called Hurricane Ida a once in 200 year flood event. And NOAA said the heat wave in the Pacific Northwest earlier this summer was a one in 1000 year event. But some social media users say these one in however many year events seem to be happening more often. So let's verify. Are rare extreme weather events happening more frequently? Our sources are NOAA, the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, and the U.S. Global Climate Change Research Program. Part of the confusion stems from the definition of a 100-year storm. NOAA says that doesn't mean a storm that hits every 100 years, but instead a storm that has a 1% chance of happening in a given year. The odds are based on past records and don't account for climate change that we're seeing today. One way NOAA tracks the impact of storms is whether they cause more than a billion dollars in damage adjusted for inflation. In the 1980s, there were less than three costly storms each year. That jumped to nearly 13 in the 2010s and 22 in 2020 alone. AccuWeather estimates Ida caused $95 billion in damage, making it one of the costliest storms of this century. So it's true. Rare extreme weather events are happening more frequently and we will likely see more one in 100 year storms in the future because that statistic doesn't account for the continued impact of climate change. With your Verify, I'm Brandon Lewis. To receive daily facts. It's good information there.